Hello, Internet! Welcome back to another TRV Storytime. Let's hit it! This has been a TRV production. Okay, so basically, this story time takes place when I was like 8 or 9, around when the Junk Brothers story time took place. So, I'm getting off the bus, I'm hyped, school's over, and... Me and all my friends were just walking home, and there's this big retention pond um, next to the bus stop, and I just see ru rustling in the bush. But then, by then, I think it's nothing. So, once we all go home, night passes, it's school again. School passes by, and it's afternoon, after school. And me and my friend Tyler from the Junk Brothers story... We were just riding around our scooters, and he had to go back home. So I'm like, okay, bye. And then I get on my scooter. I'm just riding around the neighborhood. And usually people don't go past a certain house when they're riding their bike slash scooter or whatever around the neighborhood. Because, like, that's super close to the main road. So, but since no one was around to stop me, I just rode past that one house where I'm near the bus stop now. And I'm really close to, like, all the cars passing by and stuff. And I look to my right, and that's the retention pond. And guess what I see? A baby alligator. But at the time, my stupid child brain thought it was an iguana. So I'm just over here freaking out thinking there's an iguana in my neighborhood. So I grab a massive stick and I just slap it in the face with a twig. And I'm just like... It starts growling, so I'm freaking out, so I hop on the scooter and run faster than I've ever run before. So the next day after school, when we're walking home, I'm telling everyone, like, guys, guys, there was an iguana in, in, in the retention pond, and it was like, oh my god, and I hit it with a stick, and it started growling, and everyone's like, nah, bro, I, ah, cap, cap, cap. And they're just not, they're not believing me. And my child brain is freaking out because I genuinely thought I saw an iguana. Like, dude, this isn't a tropical Puerto Rico island. There are not iguanas. So the next day after that, I'm sorry for a lot of time jumps, but it's a story that takes place over a few days. We're walking home from school again. And guess what we see? We see two massive mama and dad gators just standing there, slowly walking in their zigzag way towards us. And we're like, oh, no, nah, we gotta go. So then everyone just starts running full speed. Me and this one kid cut through someone's backyard. We were probably illegally doing that. But, like, we were just running through someone's backyard, hopped the fence to get to the other side of the neighborhood quickly. Everyone was freaking out. And no one, like, they didn't believe me. And, like, at that point, I realized that it wasn't an iguana what I saw before. It was a baby alligator. And I upset the parents. So once we all get, like group together again we're like oh my god dude that was there, there was an alligator it almost killed us and we're just sitting there reminiscing on what just happened in pure state of shock so we're just sitting there and then everyone just calls their mom and like and like animal control gets involved we see all the vans pulling up and eventually the three alligators got taken away so we're all just insane it was a crazy experience for all of us and everyone just wasn't believing me when i said the iguana thing because i mean in hindsight yeah that's super stupid and you don't really find iguanas in america so <laughs> but after all always listen to the real vacuum he's always right <laughs> just kidding i'm usually really wrong but Thank you for listening to this edition of TRV Storytimes. I'm planning on making a different type of video soon. I feel like you guys are going to like it. It's more similar to other content creators. I want to switch up my content just a little bit. I'm going to continue with the story times. Just I'm going to do a reaction video to... Well, I'll wait for you to see that. Like, subscribe, notifications, comment, alligator, if you're a real TRV fan. Bye.